Hi guys, it's Simmer Deb. Welcome to another Sims 4 Let's Build. Today I thought it would be fun to build a modern home gym, but I want to build a gym that's a little bit different and has a little bit of pizzazz to it. So I'm going to start out uh, with a little offset here. And now this gym is going to be um, a fairly large room. I think it's going to end up being about an eight by 10 uh, when we're all said and done with it because I do need to have room to fit all of my gym equipment in here. And another thing that I wanna put in this home gym is a pool. And that's what I'm planning on putting in this little offset area. Um, another thing I would like to do in this gym is I would like to put in uh, a bathroom area. So we're gonna go ahead and put a little bathroom area right here. And as long as we don't um, complete this wall, this will be considered part of the rest of the room. So it will work fine. And let's go ahead um, and throw some lighting in here uh, so that we can see what we're doing. We're just gonna go ahead uh, and use this light. And we'll just put these lights in just about anywhere for right now. And then we'll move them around when we see what we're doing. We'll need one in the bath area. And we'll put some in back here. Just throw them in anywhere for right now. Okay. Now, we need windows, and this is a modern home build, so we're going to need modern windows. See how that works? <laughs> so let's just go with this one, and we'll just go with the gray for now. We'll pop these in. And I'm going to go ahead and wrap these windows around the sides here because I'm going to design this room... Um, as a room that will stick out from the rest of the house. Um, you could have it connected here where the windows in and on this side where the windows in. You can connect it to your home there or if you don't uh, want these windows and you want the house not the room not to stick out as much if you want to connect it here you can just get rid of these windows. But for now, I'm going to put them in. Um, and of course, we're going to need a door and we're going to want a modern door. Let's do, um, what colors does this one come in? Let's do something different. Let's try this door and we'll see how that works. And we can always change it if we decide we don't like it. Um, you know, a door with windows. Okay, there we go. Now, like I said, I wanna do a pool in this home gym. So let's go ahead, well first let's put our wall covering and our flooring in. And then we'll go with the pool and put the pool in. And let's make sure that our walls are the medium height. Okay, there we go. Now, um, for a wall pattern, I'm thinking blue. How about this pretty in plastic? Let's try this and see if we like it. Okay, so far so good. And for the floor, for a gym floor, I like to use that... Um, it's not called the playground floor. It's called the soft, yeah it is, soft landing playground floor. Let's try this in the gray and we'll turn off this grid so we can better see what things look like. Now for this bathroom area though, um, let's go with a stone. Let's go with that slate tile. Is that it? Yeah, clean slate tile. Let's put that in the bathroom area because we don't really need the soft landing floor in the bathroom area. Okay, got that. And that's all looking pretty good. So let's go ahead um, and we'll put our pool in. And I, I want to do this pool a little bit differently. I want to put a fountain in it. And I think it would be neat if we went ahead um, and surrounded the pool area with plants. and had, had some really nice landscaping in it. So let's go ahead and, and do that. Um, and we'll Pull it down to there and pull it across to here. And that now we can surround this area with some nice plants and we can put a fountain in right here. Let's go ahead and do that real quick. We'll have to use move objects on. Okay, got that on. 
Now we'll go ahead and grab our fountain tool, uh, our fountain. And let's use that um, medium sprite, medium jet water emitter. Let's try that. And we'll just stick him right there for right now. And let's look and see how tall this comes up. Oops. We'll see how that does. And it, it comes up, you know, to the window height. So that's pretty good. That looks pretty good. Now let's go ahead and start working on um, our plants that we're going to put around. And let's start with a ground cover type plant so that when we're finished, it will look finished. It will be a finished looking product. I always like to use ground cover as a basis for my plants. So we'll go ahead and pop this in. And we'll go ahead and grab the triangle shape and put him in. Put him right there. Oh, he didn't click. There we go. And put him there. Okay, so now we've got a nice basis for our plants. Um, you know what? Let's add a pop of color. And one thing I was noticing is when we put in our workout equipment, our workout equipment only comes in three colors. And one of those colors is red. So let's, we'll use the red color up with the workout equipment. So let's use a pop of red color in our plants. And there is a plant uh, that I like that is red and it's a bright red. And I think it's called a lava plant or something like that. Molten volcano flowers, that's what it is. We'll go ahead and use these. We're gonna have to hold down the Alt key um, and kind of position it. It is a large flower and we don't want it to stick out through the window. So we're gonna use our Alt key to put it where we want it. Looks pretty good. And we might have to rotate it a little bit on these little corner pieces to get it to do uh, what we want to do here. I don't that I think that right there it's kind of cutting into the wall a little bit. That's probably going to be okay. Um, okay. Put in all of our others. Let's start here in the corner. And then we'll come back and put that there. How's that looking in that, on that angle? I think that probably looks okay. We might need to move this one just a little bit. Um, let's try him right there. I don't think he's cutting through the window too awfully bad. Okay. And I accidentally let go of the shift key. Uh, when you're doing this and you want to do more than one, hold down the shift key right before you place it and while you're placing it, and that will automatically pop up another plant for you to use so that you don't have to select it again. Let's do this. Okay, now let's go ahead and do this side. Let's move him around a little bit. And one last one, and now we are done. So we've got our pool area done. We've got that pop of red color. So let's go ahead um, and put our window treatments in for these windows. Uh, and we'll go ahead and use that red curtain that's like a shade, of this one right here. Let's go ahead and use this one. And let's move it up a little bit. Let's not put it right here, here, uh, well, we're going to move it up a little bit since we have tall windows, I mean tall walls, and I want to have um, 
more light coming in and more of my window exposed. So we're going to go ahead and put the window treatments at this height here. And I think that's looking pretty good. Okay. All right, so we've got our pool and fountain area complete. So let's move on to the weightlifting and exercise area. We've got our handy dandy um, punching bag here, and we'll just move him. We'll put him right here. And of course, we're going to need a treadmill. And we will choose the red one. And let's put the treadmill in the corner, kind of like that. Maybe move him back just a smidgen. How about right there? We'll put him right there. Okay, and now we're going to need our weight bench. So we'll go ahead and put Mr. Weight Bench in. And you know what? We don't need this bathroom to stick out this much. So let's go ahead and, and adjust this bathroom area. It really only needs to be two squares. So we'll just readjust that. Okay, and now we can move the weight bench over a little bit more. Put the weight bench right there. That's better, I think. And we still have room for our bathroom area, which we'll get to in just a second. Um, let's go ahead and put some mirrors on the wall, because every gym needs mirrors on the wall, I think. So we'll go ahead and do these. That's good. All right. And we need to go ahead and put this on the wall. All right, that's looking pretty good. Um, why don't we put in some countertops right here and we could go ahead and put, um, we'll go ahead and put those in and we can put some towels on top of them, some gym towels. Let's just use this counter, and let's go ahead and use the red with the dark gray top on it. Okay, we'll go ahead and do that. Um, and we'll pop some towels in here. We'll just use the two, the white towels. Pop some of those in. Okay, and what about a laundry hamper? Let's stick a laundry hamper in here. Put him right there. That looks pretty good. Okay, and let's go ahead while we're at it and put in um, some posters in this room. And I'm going to use these posters that um, are unlocked at level 5 of the athletic career, but I do have a mod, and the mod is available on Mod The Sims that lets you use these posters. Um, it unlocks them for you. So um, just download that mod from Mod The Sims and you will be able to have these posters. That's not what I'm trying to grab. I'm trying to move these lights over a little. Um, you will be able to have these posters in your build. And let's go ahead and kind of adjust these lights so that we've got them where we want to have them. We probably need to throw in one more and put him uh, I guess right there. How's that? That looks pretty good. Okay, and let's put in another poster over the hamper. We'll use that other one. There's another poster that comes with the athletic career. Here it is. And we'll make it larger. And we'll put him right here. I think that's about the same height as the other one. Yes, it is. Uh, and let's go ahead and throw a plant in right here, because we can. We'll use him. Should we go with the red? Why not? That looks nice. <laughs> okay. All right. 
Now, let's go ahead and do our bathroom area. Of course, we're gonna need a sink. So we'll start with Mr. Sink. And um, let's try this one and see what he looks like. He looks pretty good. We're going to need a toilet. <laughs> and we'll go with him. And how about this one? see what that looks like. Does that match our sink pretty well? Let's put the walls down. Yeah, I think that matches pretty well. And now, of course, we're going to need a shower, and I like this shower. Uh, it's not the most expensive shower, but I like it. And let's do it in a gray or dark gray so that it can... Does that match our sink and everything pretty well? Yeah, I think that'll be fine. And of course, we're going to need a mirror to go over our sink. And let's just use him. Put him right there. And let's put in a towel bar. And we'll go with the black towel. We'll put him right there. And of course, we need toilet paper. Got to have the toilet paper. So we will put him right there. All right, let's put a picture in right above the toilet. Um, let's, how about him? Put him in here. And what if we make him bigger? Yeah. We'll just put him right there. That looks pretty good. Let's move him up just a smidgen. so that he's kind of even with the mirror. Oh, that's close enough. That looks pretty good, pretty good. And let's put a rug in. And we'll just go with this one, this Bath Essentials rug in white. And kind of throw him in, maybe right there. That looks pretty good. Um. So we've got our bathroom done, shower, sink, and toilet. We've got our pool done with our fountain and all of our wonderful plants. And we have all of our wonderful exercise equipment in here so that we can get a really good workout. Okay. Well, I really don't think there's anything else that we really need to put in this particular gym. Um, I think it's looking pretty good. I think it does. I think I'm going to call this gym finished. I think we are done with our modern home gym. So I'll be right back with some screenshots. And here we are with the finished room. I had a lot of fun building this home gym with you, and I really like the way it turned out. I hope you all like it as well. And I'm so glad that I added that little bathroom area to the home gym so your Sims can take a shower after their workout. One thing I do need to let you know about this home gym room build. At this time, I will not be uploading this room to the gallery, and the reason is because I have found out that there is a glitch with swimming pools in rooms. At this time, if you have a swimming pool in a room, the swimming pool will not upload with the room to the gallery. So until that glitch is fixed, I will not be uploading this particular room. However, if you would like to add this home gym to your Sims home, you should easily be able to recreate it and build it yourself by following along with this video. And thank you all so very much for watching. I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did enjoy it, please let me know in the comments down below. Please leave me a like and please subscribe. I'll see you next time.